Hello everyone, I'm Sean Boyd for OES News. We are here in Butte County, specifically the town of Paradise, and this was once a neighborhood, one of the many neighborhoods that was completely destroyed by the campfire. And in fact, this home here behind me, well, it's gone, and it was once the home of a city council member. That particular city councilman is urging those of you who may be staying in tents or in your cars to get to a shelter. There are shelters open that have room for you, but you need to take advantage of those now. I'm fortunate enough that you know we're staying with family in, uh, in Chico, but we have five of us in one bedroom. But I could never be more thankful for five people being in one bedroom. Town Council member Michael Zuccololo is back in paradise, surveying the damage. We are in utter devastation up here, where it's not even safe to be here. The destruction is incomprehensible, even when you see it up close. So the thought of living outside with toxic smoke lingering throughout Butte County and beyond is also confounding. Anything else? Shelters are open and survivors of the campfire are taking advantage. Dawn Heaton came here with her granddaughter, Ariel. So, so far your experience here at the shelter has been what? Wonderful. And people here are the sweetest people I've met. Me and her, we've made a lot of friends. Um, we get we get everything we need. I mean, I need I needed a whole house full of stuff. She's been able to get food, clothing, toiletries, and even wash her clothes in this portable laundromat. There's also mental and spiritual health counseling and medical services, including free flu shots. So there's really no reason not to come here, especially with rain in the forecast. We have a very well-built facility here. Um, it's warm, it's clean, and it's more importantly, it's safe here. So anybody that comes in can be sure that they're gonna be safe and we're very welcomed here. We also have um, another facility that, um, where we're welcoming uh, pets, small pets. So anybody that has pets, they're able to come in and um, be here with them as well. But despite all of this, there are still people choosing to live in tents. It's a tough situation all around. It's not ideal and it sucks. I, I get it. But it's gonna get you through the next day. It's gonna give you a warm place to sleep. It's gonna give you a hot meal in your belly. The road to recovery is beginning. Yours can start by calling your insurance company to file your claim. Then be sure to visit the Disaster Recovery Center in Butte County. The DRC is a one-stop shop for just about everything you'll need to get going. The DRC is located in the former Sears store at Chico Mall at 1982 East 20th Street. It's open seven days a week from 9 a.m. to 7 p.m. Survivors in Butte, as well as in Los Angeles and Ventura counties with disaster-related losses, can apply for disaster assistance online at disasterassistance.gov or by calling 1-800-621-3362 anytime from 7 a.m. to 11 p.m., seven days a week until further notice. Multilingual operators are available. Of course, you should also go to wildfirerecovery.org for even more information about the state and federal response to all of these wildfires. So in addition to wildfirerecovery.org, there is also oesnews.com. There you can register for updates and find all kinds of helpful information to help keep you on the road to recovery. In Paradise, California, I'm Sean Boyd for oesnews.com.